Jack Grealish was supposedly denied entry to a bar in Manchester on Sunday after footage appeared of him looking worse for wear. The Manchester City star was seen on a night out with team, mates Kyle Walker and Riyad Mahrez. Grealish is being led away with an individual linking arms with the 26-year-old, as per the clip posted on TikTok. A person in the background can be heard saying, Jack's burst, he's not allowed inside, look at him, Jack's burst. There are a number of people around Grealish whilst the incident unfolds. City have moved to defend Grealish, claiming the event in question was before 8pm and quashed any suggestion the player was drunk. The group he was with went for a meal after. The £100 million summer signing is now facing the anger of boss Pep Guardiola, who has previously taken issue with Grealish's condition. Less than two months ago Grealish was dropped, as was Phil Foden, after not turning up to a recovery session in the right condition. Staff members were left unimpressed by the duo's conduct and Guardiola confessed he paid notable attention to how his players handled themselves off the pitch. He said at the time, I decided this team because they deserved to play. These guys and not the other ones. At Christmas time I pay a lot of attention to behavior on and off the pitch. And when, behavior, off the pitch is not proper, they are not going to play. So we have to be focused all the time because of distractions at Christmas. Time and everything that happens. You still have to be focused. City's next game is against Brentford at the Etihad. On Wednesday night, the defending champions will be looking to consolidate their lead at the top having dropped points in their last Premier League game at Southampton. They maintain a comfortable lead over closest challengers Liverpool as they aim for a fourth title in five years. Grealish was their marquee summer signing with the club making him the most expensive British player ever. The player himself confessed to Sky Sports in December, I've done okay so far. I've got so much more to give. It's been so much more difficult than I thought it was going to be. I'm still learning and adapting. I've heard some people take a year to adapt here so maybe it will be the same for me. I want to score more and set up more goals next year. It's crazy because the standards here are so high on and off the pitch. It's unbelievable and it's why they have been so successful over the years.